Welcome back to your favorite baking show, baking channel, baking with Chef Tony. Our donuts are cooled off from our previous episode. We had put them in the chiller for them to chill down so that we can cut them and show you how you pipe your cream in. So we have our cream here. So what you do, you just put the cream in, then we whip our cream uh, we are fortunate nowadays because this cream you can buy it in the shop then you whip if you don't have this one you can take fresh cream you add a little bit of icing sugar then you whip it and you put your instant thickener as you mix we're gonna do it in the other episode but for this episode we're gonna use whipped cream everything is there you don't need to add anything you just chill it then when you put you it's wiser to chill it before you whip so that it whip it gets stiff quicker. You don't need to make your, your, your cream too stiff. You just make it uh, lighter enough. Don't over whip it. Because the more you whip, the stiffer it becomes. Then when you are piping your donuts, they don't look so attractive with uh, stiff cream. Because it tends to cracky and it gives that rough uh, look the rough finish so so it's wiser to just whip it enough to so that when you are piping your piping will be as smooth as it gets so what do we do now you take your palette knife you have your so what you do you cut your donuts in the middle just like this you can see they are reddish pinkish like it's the beetroot it's a nice color uh, and they are fluffy so you open them up Cut them right through like this. So we cut them in half in a horizontal slide. There we go. So those small rounds we have them. They are here. Mm. Mm, very nice. Mm -hmm. Take your cream. 
your piping bag must be facing the other way, away from you. So what do you do? You then you close a little bit. Then your donut is ready. So it's a lot of ways of piping. Like then you close a little bit, but you leave it open. Mm. Then these round ones, what do you do? You just go. These are these donuts, then you close. Then you close. You leave the ring in, in the middle. You close them. Make sure it's well covered. Then you close. Then the rest. The other, you pipe, you can pipe. If you don't know how to pipe, you are new, you can use this other type of pipe, way of piping. Then you close. And this way, you save, it saves a lot of cream as well. Like this. Just like that. And you can see how easy it is. This is this is all what you have you do with your cream donut. Then uh, when they're like this, they are ready for anything. sugar then you can just sprinkle on top but it just adds more sugar to it or you can take a cherry then you put a cherry just it's just for decoration but this one is not for selling it's for uh, demonstration uh, so uh, it's it's that's all even this this other dessert one like this it's a nice nice donut then what you do you just sprinkle icing sugar on top and you can put a, a cherry or you can put a strawberry just for decoration but the more you put stuff the more you uh, charge so you put up you don't just put it's extras so you put whatever you put in a baker you put something extra that is not on the um, uh, initial recipe you have to add so you calculate you add you do your your, your costing then you you add more money. So the more you put stuff, the more you charge. From your resident chef signing out. See you in the next episode when we will be doing a lot of any other things, uh, breads and stuff like that. So see see in here. What's left for me? Niao to sortiao. I eat bread. <laughs>